does your laptop randomly shut down? It can be extremely frustrating, and there are many reasons why this could be happening. But don't worry, we're here to help you troubleshoot the most common causes. First, check your system for malware. Assuming your computer stays on long enough to do this, start with a malware scan using the software of your choice. You may want to consider booting from a live operating system disk, preventing the malware from shutting down your computer before it can be cleaned. Malware is a low probability cause for these types of sudden shutdowns, but since malware is easily detected, it's easiest to get this out of the way first. Next, ensure adequate ventilation. The most common reason your desktop or laptop may randomly switch off is thermal protection. There's a certain temperature threshold where the computer will turn itself off to prevent damage. Up to this point, the desktop or laptop will throttle the computer speed and rev up the fans in a desperate attempt to keep things cool. Shutting off completely is the last resort when it gets too hot to handle. Laptops are particularly susceptible to poor ventilation and need all their vents to be open with adequate access to cool, fresh air. A quick way to cook your laptop is to block the bottom vents by putting it on a soft surface like a carpet or bed or, you guessed it, your lap. If you want to use your laptop in bed, consider using a lap desk or a cooling pad to make sure there's enough air getting through to the bottom of the machine. You should also remove dust and check the heat sinks. If you've made sure there's enough ventilation, but yet the problem persists, you may be dealing with vents and fans that are clogged with dust. For most modern laptops, this isn't a complex problem to solve. Refer to your manual on how to open the main panel of the laptop. Usually, this involves removing a few screws and a clip or two. Once the laptop is open, you can clean out the fans with a brush, compressed air, or perhaps a tiny electronics vacuum. But be sure to always adhere to the manufacturer's specific advice on dust removal for your make and model. While it's exceedingly rare, it's worth quickly inspecting whether the CPU and GPU heatsinks are still correctly mounted. If the heatsinks have developed any gaps between themselves and the chips they cool, this will cause heat buildup and eventually the computer will shut down. You should also try resetting the BIOS and removing overclocking app settings. If your laptop's BIOS settings, such as overclocking, have been messed with, that could be the cause of the sudden shutdown. Instead of looking for the error in setting, it's much easier just to reset the BIOS to default. Since laptop BIOSes are designed to work with that specific laptop, you generally don't have to mess with those settings at all. What we're trying to reset in the BIOS is anything to do with overclocking, memory timings or voltages. Basically any setting that pushes a hardware component out of its factory default operating range. While resetting the BIOS to default values is a good first step, it's not enough. If you have any software that lets you overclock or modify hardware settings from the desktop, you'll need to reset that as well. If your computer is shutting down faster than you can do this, you may want to boot into safe mode. If the BIOS is reset and the computer still shuts down in safe mode, that's a sure sign the problem isn't related to overclocking or other improper hardware settings. Buggy, corrupt, or outdated drivers can be behind unwanted behaviors like random shutdowns. The answer is to make sure that your drivers are up to date. If you suspect a particular hardware component, such as the GPU, is behind your shutdowns, then download the latest drivers from the device manufacturer's website and then reinstall them. These are some of the most likely fixes, but there are five additional advanced tips in the article link below. See you next time.